All right, we are here with one of my good friends, Omema. She's also married to another one of my good friends, Zishan. And uh, Omema, thank you so much for being here, by the way. Thank you for having me. Now, I was gonna ask you, because you are like, you have your own company, Sugarworks. Unfortunately, I've had uh, the opportunity to dive into way too many of the good sweets yeah, and, and baked, you know what I mean? Right? Yeah. <laughs> no, but what, is, what do you think is the secret to good baking? Like, what do you think most people don't get when it comes to baking? It's the taste. I mean, I know it sounds simple enough, but a lot of people can put together a cake, a tart, anything, but it has to come down to like the first bite. And as soon as you just indulge, and you know you just want to keep going, that's when you know you won somebody over. I thought you were going to say something like, uh, I don't know, like the eggs, the batter, oh, the oh, milk. Right. It's like, it's an experiment if you think about it because the eggs, the batter, everything has to be the perfect temperature. Your oven has to be the perfect temperature. Everything has to be fresh, this, that. So it really comes down to like the science of it all behind it, right? It's, it can go really bad, but it can also turn into something really amazing. I've, I've tried cakes, yeah. which are amazing. Cupcakes, which are amazing. What is your signature dish? It's a tough one. Uh, I would say right now, only because uh, I've had really good feedback, would be my cheesecake. You know, I'm worried for Zishan because uh, <laughs> you guys are obviously married. Mm -hmm. And, you know, Zishan is somebody who takes good care of his uh, of his figure, and I'm just worried with all your baking that he is gonna turn into me. Like what? No, I'm worried about him. But like this? No, but like, I'm not worried. Uh, 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 does he taste it, or is he trying to avoid eating? He's very disciplined. I'll tell you this much about him: he he puts everybody to shame when it comes to being disciplined with eating. But when he indulges, I really hope he doesn't see this part. But when he indulges, he he goes for it. Tell me about. Um, the future because I, I I think you should be doubling down on content and let me just throw it out there I think you should be having your own baking show that's what I think I'm not gonna say no to anything just yet but I mean right now I do it as like a therapeutic thing I do it because it's like my little Zen garden I love it I enjoy it I don't want to turn it into anything too businessy I guess is the word but uh, Maybe I'm not gonna say no. I just see it. I think I think a show would be uh, is in the works. You have a, a a kitchen. Mo, we were just there, man. We were just in a kitchen, and we produced some really great content. Oh, it was actually mm. amazing. It was it was it was really good, and I got inspired by what these guys did. It was really cool. They had an overhead camera on like what was happening, kind of like a tasty kind of a view, plus a special guest like myself. I'm, I mean, th I think that's the future of of. <laughs> Of food. Yeah, it's not a new invention to do overhead shots, but it really shows the process of making something good. And then uh, when you see like nicely lit, good like food being made, you just get hungry. <laughs> I'm excited about you doubling down on this. Um, personally, I know this is like a hobby, but I'm just like pushing you to double down on it. And um, yeah, I wanna thank you so much for coming here to this theater. You're gonna moderate this session. By the way, are you nervous? I'm extremely nervous. I've never done anything like this, so, uh, but I'm excited. I it's gonna be fun. I think you're to be in front of the camera, <laughs> so I think it'll be fun. Thank you for being here. Thank you so much.